Now, both of you are small business owners. In New Hampshire, small businesses employ half of all workers. But a 2023 report found that one of the biggest issues for businesses is a lack of workers. What can the federal government do, Councillor Prescott, to help provide a workforce, or is this something that should be left to the free market to figure out? Oh, yes, no, we need a lot of categories to allow for work visas to come for having a green card or a work visa card to come to America and help with our unemployment rate here in New Hampshire. We have one of the lowest in the country, partly due to the re reasons why I went to the state Senate, is to make sure we bolster our economy by being fiscally conservative. And that's what the result is. We became one of the most, uh, you know, uh, fastest to come out of recession and the slowest to go into recession. This is important that we keep more employment coming from out, outside of our country. Those that have uh, options need to come as quick as possible. So we, re we reform it to make it faster and easier and, and open it up for many, many categories for work visas. And Congressman Pappas, same question. Well, as a small business owner, when you've met a payroll, uh, when you make decisions about hiring, when you get to know the larger community, provides you with a uh, great background uh, and experience that I bring with me to Washington each and every day. Uh, we've got 160,000 small businesses in the state of New Hampshire. They define the character of our state. They drive our main street economies. And as I'm talking to business owners across the state, from the Mount Washington Valley to Manchester, the conversation begins and ends with workforce. And so some of the issues that I've mentioned around affordable housing are gonna be critical for us to building the workforce that we need, addressing the the child care crisis in our state, where we have huge swaths of uh, you know, the state that can't access affordable child care, that's important to hold down costs for our families, but also to get more people into the workforce. In addition to that, I've worked uh, to partner with local communities on grant opportunities that are helping to bolster the workforce, uh, have helped secure a grant for Manchester that's expanding a skills training program in all of the city's middle schools uh, to help um, give our young people the opportunity to get into a good paying career. In addition to that, I deliver funding recently to St. Anselm College, they're using it to expand their nursing program. And so I think being smart about how we utilize these federal tools to focus on workforce and think about all the needs uh, from housing to childcare is gonna be really important.